It all started at this gas station on Florida Street in Mandeville. St. Tammany Parish Sheriff's Office says just before 6 a.m. they received a call from the store's employees. Female subject who entered a convenience store holding a blowtorch, a propane blowtorch. Uh, she didn't have it lit or anything, but she was asking questions of the clerk there. According to the sheriff's office, 37-year-old Natalie Jade Jarvis was looking for the local Department of Children and Family Services. She went back outside and she encountered some uh, some of the other customers there. Uh, it was a little bit of an altercation, not much, but the clerk called us. She was driving a school bus. Take a look at the photos Covington Police and the Sheriff's Office shared of the bus. It's graffitied and says sex trafficking awareness. Deputies say the bus left this gas station, but that they were able to locate it on Highway 190 near Walmart. Attempted to pull her over. She refused to pull over and uh, vehicle pursuit was started. It ended here at St. Scholastica Academy in Covington, where Jarvis was taken into custody. As you can see, the bus crashed into the school's fence. She does have some recent uh, history with our sheriff's office. We know her to be in the area for a, approximately a month now. Uh, and uh, that was uh, an incident where our deputies were called to uh, a state park where she was living in the bus. During that incident, deputies arrested a man who was also living in the bus on domestic abuse charges. Deputies say Jarvis had a Florida license, but the bus was tagged out of Virginia. As the investigation continues, deputies are thankful no one was hurt. No injuries and no students were here. It was prior to the school starting, uh, so we were very fortunate. The school did delay classes, but students were back on campus by 10 a.m. On the North Shore, Lily Cummings, Eyewitness News.